food tastes better when you eat it with your family, which is why I'm here in Calgary. So we're going to be making a meal tonight for the family. Ta -da! Ta -da! Smells pretty good. Holy moly, yes. Hi, Andrew. Hi, Jan. How oh my you? gosh, are you excited? Always. I love pre-chopped stuff. I have heard a bit of rumors about this recipe, and I don't believe it. Go ahead, tell us what you're going to do. Well, this is a one-pot pasta. I have one pot. There's not even any water in here. We're just going to put the pasta straight in, and then put everything else in, and switch the heat on, and then walk away. So This is a quick. perfect man recipe. So a that's dad the idea. recipe. Dad, a dad dinner that's nice and convenient. We're going to actually put the pasta in first. OK, like a Don't, whole box? Yeah, whole box. Wait. This is, I'm not even thinking about it. So straight it goes in. And then veggies, so we've got red onions, nicely yeah. chopped up. Some asparagus chopped up. Broccoli, nice and greens again, more veggies for the kids. Yes. Pretend that they don't see them. Oil, chilies. Love them. Salt and pepper okay. on top too. Pre-chopped garlic. Love or that. Not messing around. No. Chicken stock. And then some coconut milk too is what's oh, going in to kind of rise a bit of cream. Push it all down, just so that it's kind of underneath some of the liquid. Put the lid on, okay. and then and we're going to turn what? the heat on, and there you go, done. And then we walk away, and nine minutes later you're ready to go. So Andrew, why is it important to have a family dinner? Well then you can just catch up and plan and see what's going on. You know, everybody's always kind of rushing, so when we get that little half an hour that we're stopped and able to kind of actually chat before we run off to the next activity. That's exactly yeah. it. Nine minutes later. Nine minutes later, so we have some spinach oh, that nice. we're just going to put in for a little bit. Again, more greens and more... veggies. And some parmesan. There you I go. Mean, yeah. So we're just going to put the lid on. Just leave to wilt for, the spinach a bit? Yeah, exactly. Okay. Leave it for another couple of minutes and then you can taste it. Okay. Sounds Wonderful. Good? Oh my gosh, I'm excited. Easy peasy, right? I'm still kind of freaked out, but I'm very excited that yeah. it worked. It worked. Okay, Jan, here we go. It's ready to taste. Come on! This is so incredible, Andrew. It's easy. So good. I'm making Great. that. Great. The pasta's perfect. Ooh, the spice just caught up with me. There you go. See a little bit, I think. Just hit me a little bit behind the one eye. Not too much. you got to balance it out for the right kids. Very good. Got to make some more food with the kids this time. I so. can't even, I don't know how we're going to top this, but, you know, well, I love working with children. Tell me what you guys are going to make for me. Pasta salad. Pasta salad. Cheers, Cheers everybody. everybody. <laughs>